about like, well, I work at this computer place, and um, well, it's not a computer. I mean, it's a place with a lot of computers, like in a room. And um, somebody who thinks about like the erotic a lot, and um, and it's weird. Like, I can't really, you know, I can't imagine like anything happening in this room. It's just like these computers. There's nothing happening. It's just a place with like, like the computers. The computers are all just sitting there, and there's all these kind of like weird guys. I mean, I'm a weird guy, and there's all these other weird guys, and they're just like sitting there and looking at their computers, and nothing moves, you know. I mean, I thought, you know, like for railroad conductors or something, you know, it must have been different. You know, you're barreling down the rails or whatever, but you know, we're just sitting here in this room, and I'm, I'm like leaving these messages and sending messages out, like on the computer bulletin boards around the nation, like sending these these messages, you know, but. Um, I don't know. Somehow, it's not like you know what I write at home. It's it's more you know it's different. It's it's not what I what I write at home. It's more it's more inert. It's it's more like um, something you know you make it in a machine that was standing still, and um, and it's you know it's it's not sexy. It's just it's just there. It's like talking about about being sexy. But it's not like um, it's not like really sexy at all, and um, and I keep trying to be sexy. And and there's this guy, one one of the only guys I, I really like who works with me, and uh, I really like him. And uh, and it, I'd like to you know end up sleeping with him or you know having a relationship with him or whatever. And um, you know I keep thinking about sending him messages, but it seems so strange. You know you're in this room with like uh, fluorescent lights and these big computers and you know you're thinking about stuff like this and you're thinking about sending this guy a message or you know you're thinking about sending a message across the country to somebody else that you know you know about and you want to keep in touch with something like that but uh all you can do is just think how strange it is you know to be sitting here in this room like like that and um and to be writing messages like that and the other thing is, like, the boss comes around, right? And he's, like, kind of checking you out every now and then. And, uh, he's not around very often, but, you know, you kind of got to be careful about what you're writing. I mean, it's a, it's a creative firm, right? I mean, you're supposed to be writing programs. So, I mean, in theory, you know, you could be writing anything you want. But if I'm writing this message to this guy, right, about, like, how I want to sleep with him or, you know, about how I like him or whatever, you know, that kind of friendliness. And we're supposed to be making you know, programs that can, like, be sold, and, uh, I don't know, you know, I come up with excuses, they say, like, you know, it's part of, like, some interactive novel, or, or, um, you know, I think of these excuses that I would say to the boss, but, um, you know, it's, it's not anything, like, I mean, the boss never comes around, and the thing is, I never really write anything, so then I go home, right, and I, um, my computer's broken, so I'm writing in my journal, and everything just you know flows out. It's really easy. It's it's in pen, but um, you know I never uh, like when I make mistakes in pen, I, I sit there and cross them out. Like most people just like draw a line through the word that's wrong, and I just like I have to like ex like put this big black mark right. So on ballpoint pen, I'm like scribbling and scribbling and scribbling. If I get one word wrong, you know I make this big sort of black block over it because. I, I'm just the kind of person who, you know, if I make a mistake, I really want to just sort of obliterate it, right? So, so I spend a lot of time, um, you know, erasing my mistakes, which in computers you just, you know, move the cursor or whatever. I mean, the computer is much more convenient, but, um, but I don't know. Somehow, when I'm in the room with the computers, I can never really, I can never really say what I want to say. I can never really think, you know, I can never really feel the feelings of love that I yearn for when I'm by myself. <laughs>